Hello everybody and welcome back to my time at Porsche where at the moment we are still sort of um, building up the house a little bit with furniture and stuff like that. We are also um, trying to build another firepower generator but it's going a little slowly so I need an industrial engine for it. I've got three, it's fine. A bunch of data disks and old parts and stuff like that that we can just pop in there. Um, we have a whole inventory full of rubbish, pretty much. I've got gems there as well, power stones. Power stones are running out a bit, which is why the generators are going to be good because eventually it'll mean that I can use wood from the tree farm and actually we haven't been up to the tree farm in blooming ages so I need to go up there and uh, so it can start collecting wood for me again because it gets to a certain maximum amount and then you sort of start losing the wood so I need to pop up there for the sake of 12 minutes each way every day I think we could make more of an effort to come up here And speak to Dawa every time as well. Why not? Chat to Dawa. Life here in Porsche is so cozy. Feel it with your heart. I'm pretty sure you'll love it. I'm not like really worried about giving Dawa everything he wants. I'm just like, you know, a little chat to him though doesn't hurt. There's some people that I'm really like, yeah, we'll give you loads of gifts because you're an interesting person. But Dawa, I don't know. We can work on him later, I'm pretty sure. Okay, so, we Got all this wood we can fire up the generator with, because it needs a bit of a refuel. That's two out of two, so that's another day's worth of fuel in it. So it seems like each morning at around, around this time, I can sort of fuel it back up and it'll keep going for a day I don't need to fuel it again at night then you see which is pretty nice and it's really quite obvious what like I look there and I'm like oh it's out it's nothing is burning um the whole setup is out so it's a lot easier for me to spot when it's uh needing a bit of a refuel let's have a look at all these a couple of hours we'll have some uh oh we've got some crystals Nice. And we're going to have some nitro today as well. Nice. Very nice. It's about the only way I've found to get nitro is the trees, to be honest, at the moment. I've not found any in any rocks or anything like that. Despite people saying that we, that I did, I would. Uh, it's a bit strange. Okay, so I'm going to have a look and see how many copper coils I have, if any, in here. Is it zero? I think it's zero. So I've got 57 of these uh, copper wires and I've got 10 of these iron bars. So I'm hoping that'll be enough for me to make five copper coils. Which it is. Nice. Okay, so we've made those. I can pop those onto the furnace. Uh, have I put the engine on? Yes, I have. It's the steel plates now. How many steel plates do I have? Um, I have only zero in there, so I've stashed them somewhere. Probably in here. I have six. Uh, so I need four more. I have three being made there. Oh dear. I need one more. And I can make one more. Yay, so that'll be ready in two hours time. Okay, what else do we need? Our civil furnace, so I'll go and get that out of the chest. So I took all the civil furnaces down. I've got a spare industrial furnace as well, actually. So we'll have a proper setup of four straight away as soon as it's done, which will be very nice. And I need to be work, oh, I need to put some more hardwood boards on so I can work on this uh, flooring. Yeah, that's the silver furnace part of it. 
So let's get some hardwood and start getting that all chopped up. Oh, we've got some hardwood plank. Okay. It's hardwood plank and copper coil, isn't it? To make that flooring. And I'm going to need... Well, we needed one, two, three, four, five, six for that side. So I assume we'll need about the same for this side. And it'll probably be a little bit of a mess to start with and then I'll sort of work out where I want everything. Um, where's my conductive floor? Furniture, isn't it? So I need to maybe go out five more. There we are. And I'll just pop all those down while we're waiting for that last steel plate to be made. So conductive flooring. I need to pick up the furnace here. I don't think it's doing too much at the moment. It's completed its uh, crafting. So I'll pick that up. Put the flooring down where I want it. And of course, it's going to be a nightmare to place. It's always a total nightmare to place. There we are. Two. Three. Five. Now, is that sticking out a bit much on one side? Kind of think it is. I feel like the whole lot could just come across one. Yeah, it does need to, doesn't it? I'm going to go and... You're going to hate me for this. Chop all of this up. And move it back one. This stuff's a, such a nightmare to put down. It just doesn't do what you want it to do. It does what it thinks it wants to do, not what it's supposed to do. It's trying to I don't know if it's trying to even snap into place, but I really want to try and there. I think it needs to be there. That will be sticking out quite a bit. Um, no, I think I think that will be right. I think it will be right. So let's just pull these up. And then I may need to do the same on the other side just to make it a little bit more symmetrical. Just shift it along a tiny bit. I like things to have a bit of symmetry and to look nice if I can. Not always possible. I might even have all the grains of the wood going the same way. You never know. This is the last one. Oh, come on. Just place. Thank you. Okay. Yeah, it's never going to quite be right. It's always going to be one way or the other slightly off. Um, but I feel that that's not too bad. Considering the sizes of the machines I'm putting on there, it's uh, it's fine. So I'll put the industrial furnaces down. So one, two. And then hopefully by the time I've done that and placed them all properly, my generator will be ready. I hope it fits in that tiny space. Have I only put down five instead of six or something? Because that does look like a really tiny space. Hmm. I'm certain I put six down. Oh well, I'm sure we'll soon see. <laughs> we'll soon see if it fits or not. Okay, so I've got my ten steel plates to go on there. Ready. Nice. Okay, so let's see if this actually fits in the space I've given it. Which it does not. We are one short. And I would say that if we are one short, we need... to put down one more piece of conductive flooring. Which on that side is going to look ridiculous. Ridiculous. 
I'm never going to get this right. Is I'm going to have to play with this so much before it gets to be exactly right. I'm sorry, guys. I think I'm going to have to pick them up again. I think I had it right to start with. So I think this needs to be sticking out one more. Uh, I hate this plating mechanic. I wish I could just place it where I wanted rather than where my character was moving. So, no, oh, it was right there. It was right there a second ago. Come on. Perfect. Normally, once we've got them lined up, it's a little bit easier. I can't believe how late it's gotten as well. I'm not even going to have time because I've been spending so long doing all of this. I'm not even going to have time to go down and get my commission if I'm careful. Oh, look, there's a fireside meeting. Yay! I don't care, I'm going in here. See what I can pick up. So, desk lamps, bombs, or an Emperor Goliath. 800 for an Emperor Goliath. If I get one, I'm going to keep it. I think desk lamps might be the best. I know at least I can make those. At least I think I can. I feel like I'm taking the meeting, but I'm not. I love how Paulie's at the back, like just doing some gym, you know. Gotta get that workout in. So these trees, even without, um, any fertilizer they don't do too bad no do not do that i'm really glad that it checks really glad it checks i hope this looks all right once i've done it now I think that's as even as it's going to be. Okay, cool. Right, so uh, probably starting off with the furnace. Then I'll put the generator down. And it's this way around, I believe. Then the generator. furnace so much wiggling around needing to be done here but I believe that will be that will be fine and I may just move this set up across one or two I'm not gonna do it today because I'm so fed up I am so fed up right so we're probably gonna need to make some more charcoal so we'll make a bit of that well let's turn this on shall we Refuel you with five iron wood. Power you on. Right. So, charcoal. Let's make some charcoal. Maybe make some iron bars or something. Oh, we can make a few more carbon steel, actually, apparently. There we go. Make glass, bricks, copper, charcoal, all sorts. So that's going to be another 13 hours. That's going good for a day. That's going good for 17 hours. So this is so much better of a setup for my furnaces. I'm kind of thinking that it might be quite nice to move like all the rest of the stuff like into the middle and then have the furnaces all the way along an edge or something. But we'll see. Maybe after the next expansion. Which, you know, we are already like well on the way. We're like already back to 20k or something crazy 
So I think that tomorrow, so for the rest of the day, now I've done all of that, I'm just going to put away all of my stuff. And then... Alright, I wanted a chest for relics, didn't I? So this one back here, we can just pop some relics in there. I've got nowhere else to really put them otherwise. Sort that. I wish it sorted a bit more like into types like metal and food and stuff like that. I think it might might be sorting alphabetically or something. So this is my farming chest. It hasn't been named as such yet, but eggs and pumpkins and things like that will probably go in there. Maybe apricots. We actually have 92 apricots at the moment, actually. Didn't realise that. Mm. Meat and stuff probably needs to go in the food chest, but I'd like to keep that on me anyway. I haven't used the carpet making skyver yet, but that's maybe something I could look into because that seems to be the way I get my defense stuff is making loads of different carpets. Uh, I would love the poor one off the merchant, but that's maybe something for another day. That may need to be upgraded pretty soon, actually. So the rest is all wood. Oh, there's crystals there. They need to go in there. And that lead needs to go into there. The soil actually needs to go into the farming chest. Gotta put that in there instead of the stone one. It makes more sense to me. Um, stone and sand and then wood. And then we can go to bed in the safe in the knowledge that we've got lots and lots of wood and stuff. Hmm. That's nearly done with its uh, carbon steel bars, actually. Yeah, we can go to bed safe in the knowledge that we can go into the ruins and stuff tomorrow without too much of a worry. So I'm going to pick those up. And I'm going to pop in here. And I'm going to get the iron. And then we'll make some more carbon steel bars in here. Try and make it so that they never run out. Now I've made it so much easier and quicker to make everything by setting up this whole thing with the generators. I don't want to waste any opportunities with it. So when I see it go down to one, I really should be trying to replenish it as well. As I say, I may well get to the point where I'm like, yeah, I want that actually build some more of these and have like rows and rows and rows of these massive industrial furnaces. It'd be pretty cool. Okay, time for bed, I think. So in the morning, I'm going to want to go into the abandoned ruins too. I'll just go and check on all my furnaces before I do that. Uh, I'll go into the abandoned ruins too. I'll maybe take a commission as well. Oh yeah, we've got a commission for desk lamps. Yeah. What do we need for desk lamps? What do we need for a desk lamp, guys? Oh, it's the first of autumn now. Ooh, that will mean, that will mean that I've got my rankings today. So we're gonna be getting first place. Yay, Congratu congratulations on obtaining the number one position in the workshop rankings last month. You're a model workshop and an inspiration for the rest of us. We're very glad to see such a wonderful workshop here in Porsche. We hope you continue to show such quality. Here is your reward for the number one rank. Commerce Guild. So we got 20 tempering liquid, 20 data discs and two wind wheels. How awesome is that? But that does mean I need to go put those away. Uh, not in the food chest. We do not want tempering liquid in the food chest. It'll contaminate everything. So we've actually got a lot of data discs at this point. I don't know what to do with these wind wind wheels. Like, I know they sell for 400 each, but I'm like, do I need them for something? They don't really go anywhere or do anything, but I have this feeling I need them. I have this really, really sneaky suspicion that I need them. And that I won't be able to get them if I sell them. 
and I think I need to I need to keep my sneaky suspicions in mind sometimes. Why have we got hardwood in there? That's meant to be like an attic chest. We also have two uh, water tanks, not to be mistaken for a fish tank. Stop putting fish in there and they all die. Oh, that'd be terrible. So I'll just have a quick check of all the uh, bits that are going along here. So the crafting has been completed in this one, which means I need to get some more, uh, put those away, get some more iron. Take some charcoal from here, put some more charcoal on if I can. I need the wood. Probably need to re do some refueling as well, so we'll just do that. Ah, so now that's down to one out of two. Oh, I accidentally turned it off. <laughs> so I can refuel it with four more ironwood. Ah, right. So I can top it up. Can I do the same with this? Yes, I can. I can refuel that. Tank is already full, but it's... Oh, is it one out of two maybe how much it's actually... Ah, that's how many machines it's powering at the moment. One out of two. Interesting, actually. So I want this one to be doing some charcoal. Again. So it only takes six hours per charcoal. I need to keep checking back on that one. It doesn't take as long as you might think. And some carbon steel bar. I'll need to do some tin alloy as well at some point, but just keep it going with all of these things. It's done three out of ten of those. It'll still be another 16 hours. That one's nearly done though, so that needs topping up. But we have no more charcoal left, apparently. Let's see if there's any in here. Yes, there is. So let's just pop that in there and do some more carbon steel bars. Nine will do for now. It'll take a day to do them. This is a really nice setup, actually. I like it. I like it a lot. So we'll put all the wood back in there. Put all the metal back in there, and then we can gallivant off to the mines. See if we can find any cool stuff, like relics and things. Hi, Remington. How are you doing? The safety of Porsche is my number one priority. If you see anything suspicious, just tell me. See, this is this is why they need writers, so they can spell suspicious. Getting um, very good bug testers though that are picking up all these spelling mistakes and they are slowly getting ironed out, which is fantastic. Okay, so I'm gonna. Oh, I haven't made my desk lamps yet. Urgh. Like I'm gonna make. I'm gonna pick up another commission. It's like I haven't even done the one I've got. So I'm gonna see if I do have the stuff to make the desk lamps first, and then we'll head down the mines. <sighs> it's hard life being me. Cable, I still need a pulley, and that pulley still needs lubricant, so it's so annoying. Unless I can find a pulley somewhere. But it's really frustrating that I still haven't found any lubricant. Like, I've been mining for ages. <sighs> I can't buy it anywhere, I don't think, anyway. I've not seen it. Anyway, let's work on this uh, desk lamp. So copper bar, glass, and copper wire. I think I can do that. Glass... Copper wire. Copper bars will probably be in the metal chest. And then we can get those out of the way. They're not going to be too difficult at all. I do love the way that the seasons change here. They've done a really nice job of that, I feel. Okay, desk lamp. I can make ten of them, apparently. I don't think I want to make ten of them yet. So I'll put the glass away. The copper wire away. Trying to be neat here and put the metal away in the metal chest. 
Okay, then we'll go and hand the desk lamps in to whoever it is that wants them. Which is... Russo, apparently. It's down the other end of town, so we'll take the DD over there because I'm so lazy that I can't even be bothered to run to the other end of town. But then, considering how much effort it was to make that DD stuff, I think it's fair enough that I, I should use it now. There's Russo. Hello, Russo! Pretty much the only time I ever get any any social with you is when we do commissions. That'll do, apparently. Plus 25 relationship with him for doing that, so I like to do... Oh, come to steal your stuff. There's a bar there. <laughs> Stamina minus 15. Oh no. Nine goal. Thanks, Higgins. Be gone, competition. I'm already crushing you. Thanks, Higgins. You are. You are no match for me. Hey, Ak. I might have some old parts on me. I'm learning more and more about the world from Petra. I can't believe how much has changed. Also, I haven't had any interfacing time since I've been here. It's very different. I don't have any direction. Oh, bless him. Mm. Oh dear, I don't have much I can give you. Um, I'll give you a copper bar. I guess. Sorry, dude. That's what I stole off Higgins. <laughs> Why wasn't it a bronze bar? It looked like a bronze bar. Oh well, I got extra friendship with Ak for free, so... Oh well. Okay, so I think now uh, that we've had a little... Had a little run around and we've handed in our desk lamp and stuff. We can pop into the abandoned ruins too and have a look for more relics and have a look for anything else that we can dig up. Primarily looking for lubricant still to finish off that last quest. It's dragging on ridiculously it does mean that mint gets to hang around a bit longer which is pretty cool but i'm sure he probably wants to go home i would if i were him i was like that's that lazy builder she hasn't even found like all she has to do is make one piece of steel cable and she hasn't even done that i wish i'd given it to higgins oh arlo i always don't bring a i should always bring a practice sword up when i go to abandoned ruins too because arlo's always there yeah, we'll have a new area. That last one didn't have a ton of stuff in it. Okay, let's go. Let's see what we've got. What have we got? Anything? No. Ah, oh, something down all the way, all the way down there. Nah, let's let's keep running around and see what else we've got. Oh wow, this is an interesting one. Let's see what this is like in here. There's one right under my feet. I always annoys me when that happens because I can't actually... I don't have enough like camera angle to get to it. Camera mobility or whatever it is. Please be some lubricant. Oh no, okay, I found the soldier piece five. I've got piece three, piece four, and piece five. So I'm looking for piece one and two now. That's pretty cool. I might actually be able to make the soldier soon. There's one like right down there. Let's see if it's closer if I go down in this hole. Not particularly. I'm not getting very lucky mining missions at the moment as far as like finding the relics is concerned and finding the the bits and bobs. I suppose I get soil and sand. Soldier with lance piece five. So the second piece five. The thing is, I suppose if I get lots of multiples, I could maybe get an extra soldier out of it eventually. So that might be quite cool. See what's down here. Is there anything down this in this tunnel? 
Nope. I think I've had everything around here, so we'll we'll run back out of the tunnel, I think. And see if there's another way. I'll go and get that one, I guess. Oh my goodness, it's really bad. Really bad. Simple circuits and old parts again. Where am I supposed to find lubricant then? Because I'm really not finding it in here anywhere. Nope. I might have to reset this, you know. I think I've had all of them. It's ridiculous. Yeah, at least at least I get to go in for a whole week and I don't have to like pay again to come in. So I can go outside and reset it. That was a really bad mine, that one. Okay, let's uh, try again. A different area. And hope we get some lubricant in this one. Grr. It's getting a bit ridiculous now. Okay, I'm hoping to press F and the whole place to light up. That's not as bad, actually. Not as bad as it was last time. Not a ton better, but not as bad. And this one's in the middle of an iron vein, so that's useful. Power stone, simple circuits, and a spring. Yay! If, if I jump back down this hole, will I be closer to that thing? Yes. Very close, actually. Simple circuits. Mm -hmm. Can't have it all, I guess. You can believe it. It's so difficult to get a blooming piece of lubricant. A bottle of lubricant. That's all I need. Ridiculous. Some people are saying maybe I'm too good at fishing because um, I always catch stuff and it's maybe like a booby prize that you get the rusty pipes. I'm not really sure. Well, I think when I did get rusty pipes before, I caught the fish, but then it immediately just pulled back out. Simple circuits and old parts. People say I'm in the right place here, so I'll keep going. I'm just having ridiculously bad luck. More large iron buckets. Like, ridiculously, ridiculously bad luck. And the more things they add in, the worse it gets, because the more likely you are to find a relic instead of finding the lubricant now. Eyeglass. Honestly, if it told me I had to fight like three chemical dropouts in a row, I'd rather do that than this. <laughs> I have no idea where it all is. Power stone and spring, okay. There's a few more dots around the place though, so we can just live in hope. Oh, shall I eat apple slices is the question. Restores health, restores max stamina percentage. Soldier with the blade and soldier with the lance. Oh, so we've got different soldiers now. 
I think I think we should only use the um, the stamina we have each day. Well, there's one right there. Okay, okay. Let's just have one one apple slice and see if that's enough to get us to this last one. Because it, you know, that could be the piece we need. Oh, apparently we are now level twenty nine though. Yay! New relic, soldier with scepter. Piece three. A lance, a blade, and a scepter. Wow. There's a lot of different soldiers we're finding down here. I think we've pretty much uh, pretty much exhausted our options now, so back to the back to the ranch. And so yet yeah, another unsuccessful day of finding anything that's actually going to help us with our two side quests. Uh, well, our main quest actually, I suppose. However, I don't think that there's anything more to the game to be opened up once we've um, done those things. So it's not the end of the world for me. I'm just happily sitting here taking my commissions and... Uh, expanding 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 getting better equipment and tools and things like that i also need to go and see you know i'm trying to upgrade my house as well trying to make sure that i've got enough furniture in it to max it all out i've maxed out my weapon and my pickaxe i haven't maxed out my axe yet so i need to work on that as well but there's a few things to do and uh, sort of maybe rearranging the place a little bit making it look a little bit nicer because it's a little bit these setups are a little bit big for where i've placed them i feel so i feel they might be better like um along the sides and then have some of these um things in the middle maybe even move that out of the middle i'm not really sure yet could, could even have trees in the middle or something and stuff around the outside you know i i just don't know i don't know and this is going to be a hundred and twenty thousand goals. I do not have enough money to buy this at the moment. Well, well, well. Surprise, surprise. How much do we have now? Still eighteen thousand. Got lots of different relics now. We've got a soldier with scepter piece three, soldier with lance, soldier soldier with blade. Can't talk now. I'll put them into my chest, and we'll see what we've got. So it's easy a blue soldier, that's the lance soldier. We've got piece three, four, and five of that. We have the scepter and the blade, but we've only got one piece each of those. So we're collecting them up. And you know what? That's a really nice thing because we have to go into the mines a lot at the moment. So it's nice to be collecting these little soldier pieces and things. And eventually I might be able to put something together in the big machine. And that would be pretty awesome. Anyway. Time for bed, I think. And time for the end of the episode too. So I hope you enjoyed it, even though there is a lot of grinding going on at the moment just to get things um, as I want them to be. Getting the workshop as I want it to be, getting all the things I need to do, the quests, and they just aren't coming. They're just not... I'm just not finding them, so it's kind of annoying. I might go through level three and four of the hazardous ruins just to see what I find. But we'd better go to bed before uh, she lab passes out. So I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, then please do leave me a like below. And if you'd like to see more Porsche, please do subscribe. I'll let you know when the videos are out. I hope to see you next time. In the meantime, please look after yourselves and keep being awesome.